Hi, for this recording, I'll show you how to answer question 2 on Riemann integral. This question concerns the function f of x equal to 1 plus x for x between 0 to 1 third and 2 minus x for x between 1 third and 1. And the first part of the question is to sketch the graph. And the second part is find the lower Riemann sum of the partition and upper Riemann sum of partition where the partition is from 0 to 1 third, 1 third to half, half to 1. Now what this question is all about, let's look at the PowerPoint slide. Okay, So we have a partition on A, B in general. Let's say A, the partition of, of uh, A to B is usually x0 to x1, x1 to x2 and so on. And usually x0 is A, xn is B. And the length of the interval is delta xi, is xi minus xi minus 1. And on the interval, you can find the infimum, small m, infimum of fx on the interval, and the supplement of the function on the interval. And the lower Riemann sum is actually the infimum times the delta xi, and then summing up all over the partition, interval of partition. And the upper Riemann sum is actually the supplement multiplied by the length of each inside interval and then summing up. So let's look at the solution now. Okay, so the solution in this case first we have to draw the graph. So the graph in this case consists of two pieces. First from 0 to 1 third, right, from the point x equal to 0 to x equal to 1 third we have a straight line y equal to 1 plus x y equal to 1 plus x and notice that when x equal to 1 third is excluded this is an open circle and then from x equal to 1 third to, 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 one, to half 1 third to 1 is another straight line y equal to 2 minus x and notice that these are two solid circles at the end point Okay, then we look at partition. The partition in this case is actually, uh, we have the partition is from 0 to 1 third, 1 third to half, and half to 1. So these are the three partition. Okay, the partition in this case, the three partition. Okay, so for the three partition, 0 to 1 third, 1 third to half, half to 1. For the first partition, the length of the interval is 1 third. The second partition, the length of the interval is half minus 1 third. Half minus 1 third is 1 over 6. Okay, and for the third partition, The length of the interval is half. Now on the first interval, the smallest or the infimum for the first interval, in this case m1 is equal to 1. And the supplement on the interval from 0 to 1 third in this case is here. Right? And this is a point 2 minus x, x one third now, this is 5 over 3. Then on the second interval, from one third to half, the infimum, in this case lowest value of y is here, is m2, when x equal to half, 2 minus half is 3 over 2. And the largest value of y of supplement in this case on the second interval is here also m2 is 5 over 3. On the third interval, the smallest value of y or infimum in this case is m3 is 1, value of y is 1, 
and the largest value of y in this case is here is m3 equal to x equal to half y equal to minus x3 over 2. So putting all these together, then I have but on the partition you have this information. Okay. So in this case the information on the first interval, information on the second interval, information on the third interval. Then the lower Riemann sum in this case is summation of all the infimum and the length of interval which is a 1 times 1 third, 3 over 2 times 1 over 6, 1 times 1 over 2 and when you multiply them out you get 17 over 18 which is 0 0.9 this is uh, 1.055 Oh, sorry, it's uh, 0 0.944. 0 0.944. To find the upper Riemann sum, you have to multiply the supremum and the length interval in this case. So it's 5 over 3 is 1 third, 5 over 3 is 1 over 6, 3 over 2 is 1 over 2, right? So this is what we do. And this will give us 19 out of 12, which is 1.5833. So, uh, that finished the solution for question 2A.